For more videos visit for the sake of education.com. All right guys, now we're gonna do this problem that says the window is held open by chain A through B. Determine the length of the chain and then express the force in Cartesian vector form and find its coordinate direction angles. So first what you need to find is the position vectors, the position for A, A X, A in the Y and A in the C. Now let's see, A in the X is equal to five cosine of 40 because you know that the length of the window from here to here is five. Five because when the window is closed, you should close the whole thing if it was a good window. And you know that this angle is uh, 40. So this length right here is five cosine of 40. In the Y is equal to eight feet. That is one big window. And the, in the C, should be from here to here, it's gonna be five sine of 40. So this is 3.83 and this is 3.21. So A is equal to 3.83i plus 8j plus 3.21k. Now B, is equal to zero in the i because it sits at the yc plane plus five in the j plus 12 in the k now we have to find the vector that goes from a to b and this is vector b minus vector a which means that this is bx minus ax i plus by minus ay j plus bc minus ac k when you plug the numbers in for the v and the a vector you're gonna get that this is equal to negative 3.83 i minus 3j plus 8.79k yeah okay so now we need to find the magnitude of this vector and the magnitude can be found by doing the square root of the x square plus y square plus c square so each of the components square and square rooted you plug in these three values in here and you're gonna get that the magnitude is equal to 10.04. So 10 is a very nice number to have in a problem. You're gonna find that the uni vector AB is equal to the vector AB divided by the magnitude AB, which is equal to 0.381i minus 0.299j plus 0.875k almost the same numbers now that you have the uni vector and you know that the magnitude of the force is 50 pounds the Cartesian vector form of the force can be found by multiplying the magnitude times the uni vector direct uh, the uni vector the uni vector is this vector right here and it has a magnitude of one so when you multiply these three values by the magnitude of the force, you get that the Cartesian vector form of the force is negative 19.05i minus 14.95j plus 43.75k. Now they want you to find the coordinate direction angles. And the coordinate direction angles can be found by doing the cosine inverse of the x component over the magnitude the y component over the magnitude and the c component over the magnitude 
So the cosine inverse of each of these values with the sine, don't forget the sine, divided by the magnitude of f right here. So you get that is equal to 112.4 degrees, 107.4 degrees, and 28.96 degrees. Final answer for the direction angles and final answer for the Cartesian vector form of the force acting along the chain. Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.